we have the best platform in Imagine Bank to test new features, new services that later we can adapt to the main bank, to the Caixa Bank. Welcome to the Bankers Masterclass Series in association with Caixa Bank on best practice in digitalization. We're filming on location in Barcelona at Caixa Bank's headquarters. I'm Joy McKnight, Deputy and Technology Editor at The Banker, and I'm joined by Xavier Mas, Chief Marketing Officer, to talk about the lessons drawn from Imagine Bank, Caixa Bank's mobile-only bank for digital natives. Xavier, thanks so much for joining us today. Thank you. So can you tell me a little bit about what lessons you've learned in the two years since Imagine Bank was launched? From my perspective, uh, we have learned three main lessons. First, we spent a lot of money and time and resources in order to understand the consumer's insights. So what I have learned is that if you fit the consumer needs, you will uh, really success. And that's what we have done with Imagine Bank that has today almost one million customers. Secondly, what we think is it is very important to explain very well across the organization the objective that has such a disruptive proposal. As you know, we are a traditional bank and all of the employees in branches, in, in headquarters, uh, must understand very well the objectives of this new di bank division. You know? And finally, we have learned that we have the best platform in Imagine Bank to test new features, new services that later we can adapt to the main bank, to the Caixa Bank. Okay. And so what trends are you really seeing within millennials' behavior that is impacting on banks? Well, what we have seen is that today consumers from uh, Imagine Bank, they use our platform, new, the new app, much, much more than what they used to, to use it, the, the, the Caixa Bank standard. So if you fit a, a basic services very user friendly, you, you will succeed that first. Second, these uh, millennial target or younger, they, they adapt very well the new payment methods. So this adoption rate is, very, is much higher than the rest of the consumers. Okay, and then how are you using sort of the information that you're gathering to really shape the new products and what products you're putting into the market? We are trying to develop the, the products as easy as possible because you know, we know that uh, they, they want really uh, user-friendly services. For example, when we launched Imagine Bank two years ago, the on onboarding process couldn't be 100% digital mm -hmm. due to the regulations. Today. It is, and we have uh, seen a higher adoption, adoption rate due to this new process, only digital. Okay, um, and then you also, in December, you launched Imagine Cafe. Can you tell me a little bit about sort of the concept behind that and the reasons behind it? Yes, as you know, we launched Imagine Bank two years ago as an app, but we know this is not enough. We want to create engagement with the consumers. When we study, the millennial behavior, we know that traditional publicity doesn't work enough. We know they prefer, or they, they believe much more the recommendations of their friends or influencers than the traditional publicity. So we start thinking how we can do something alternative. And then we, we create the idea of Imagine Cafe that this is a platform a physical platform based on the center of Barcelona in a north branch, big branch, 1,200 square meters, where a lot of activities that our, cons our customers, millennials, they, they like it. For example, music, entrepreneurship, talks, there is a coffee there, there's a expositions, many things, even a gaming place. This is a really interesting place, but the idea and the concept is beyond the physical space. Everything that happens there 
it's in the streaming on the social networks. That's the idea. We want to create engagement with the consumer beyond the bank proposal in order to uh, they talk about Imagine Bank much more than as a bank. So it's been such an interesting journey and I've been tracking it for some time, but what is next for Imagine Bank? Yes, well, we, we, we want to continue with this path. The best and user-friendly platform with basic services for this target and also create uh, this concept beyond a bank to, in order to have the better engagement with the consumer and to continue being leading in this market. Excellent. Thank you so much, Chabi. Thank you.